I just got back. You ready to run out the door? I already had plans, that's why. My friend's picking me up. Victoria came home from college. And I don't know, I mean, I thought she was coming home to visit for at least a couple of days, not a couple of hours. So what time is your friend coming anyway to pick you up? Uh, I think soon. Is that him? Probably. Hi, Luke. Who is this clown anyway? When it comes to guys and my daughter, red flags go up immediately. How are you doing? Yo, Good, how are you? Yes. How are you? I'm how are you doing? Nice to nice meet, meet you. Oh, I'm Teresa. I always get nervous to, like, let my friends come around because, one, my mom is crazy and loud and probably will scare them away. And my dad will probably scare them away because he's so intimidating. Are you guys boyfriend-girlfriend? No, no, no. So, Luke, you yes. look like a very nice young man. Why are you friends with my daughter? <laughs> You're a nice girl. You're a nice girl. Yes. You sing, the tattoos. Oh, and I'm only staying for a couple of hours. I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> she liked us up at school. Yes. Also. Is she just loud? Louder. <laughs> when we were in the kitchen, all of a sudden I look over at my mom, and she's doing the lip thing. So I know something's about to happen. Well, I don't know if Victoria told you or not, but I'm a medium, which means that I'm able to speak to people that have crossed over. Yes. I was just told you have a memory tattoo. I did. Is that a, did, you, did you lose your mom? I did, yes. My mother passed away four years ago from a disease called scleroderma. Does everyone in your family have an L name? Because I feel like Luke, Laura, Linda, Larry. It's uh, Lauren, Luke, and Leanne. She's like, everyone in the <laughs> So please know that it's just her way of acknowledging also your other siblings. And it knows how difficult it is at times. You don't have to believe in what I do. No, it, I, it, I, I, that's, I'm not asking you to do that. Your mother is just taking this opportunity to let you know how proud she is of you. And very proud of the young man that you're becoming. How's that? That sounds good. Um... But can I ask you, do you like that I'm a 13? Oh, that's crazy that you know that. <laughs> I'm crazy like yeah, that. Crazy. <laughs> Not crazy like her. I'm crazy in a different way. The day she, uh, of her funeral, when she passed away, I played in the game. And I scored 13 points, and she passed away on January 3rd, which is 1-3. So it was sort of like... So you can connect with the number 13 in minutes? Yes. yes. Do you go back to the day that she died? Yeah, all the time. And you keep going back and saying, why did I go out that day? I should have stayed with her? There's, there's one day, uh, it's the last day she could really talk, and I didn't, I didn't go to the hospital, because I figured it was just another, she always went to the hospital, so I figured it was just another one of those trips. So I decided to stay home, and it was the last day she could talk, really, and I didn't get to say But this is what I love what your mom has done. She told me that you keep going over and over that day, correct? Yeah. She doesn't want you to feel guilty or carry any negative emotions connected to that and showed me that nothing was left unsaid. So know that she does not want you to keep going over and saying, I should have gone that day, her last day of being able to communicate. So she would like you to release that burden to her. And she says, and I want you to replace it with this moment of me telling you how proud I am of you. I always had a ton of regret knowing that I didn't get to talk to my mom. Your mom just said no regrets. So please know that anything that you go back and say, oh, I should have stayed, I should have went, I should have done it, she says, I don't want you to. Okay. I feel relieved because just to know that my mom could hear me and to know that we didn't leave anything left unsaid means a lot to me. I hope I didn't intrude no, no, across no, 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 any not lines. At not at all. Even though Victoria only came home for a couple of hours and drove us completely nuts, it was still really nice to see our baby girl. All right, very nice meeting you. You too.